Okay, this is the last uh, render we do. And uh, here you see there is a few uh, blown here. It's, a, it's not good. You can bring up your lights and you can find another way, but this, this is uh, one result. You can also save uh, the frame. You can click right on the mouse button, you can save frame. And when you can save frame, you can choose where this frame is saved, okay? So this is one way. Also, the other tools here, display option and display option. You can also have the display option here, or I can also inspect for check our color here. If there is some pixel is uh, uh, go over the value of one. Every pixel, for example, here, there is something maybe no, we are good. Every pixel here, if you go up or our value, you can find, you can see here in the, the first the third line, there is a value of your color. If your color is go up one, for example, 1.2, 1 1.01, 1 1.05, it's uh, the burn area. But uh, you can uh, Make sure it's not a burn area in this case, and in this case it's good, okay? So there is the way for create lighting, and also the, there is all techniques, more techniques you can use it. It's more near maybe to the world of the photography, so you can maybe you can recreate the set photography setup, but this is one way, one way for create for, for example, the object in this case, you know, we can. Okay. Another things we can do that now, it's uh, the setting, for example, the, another material from this object. And for setting material, now we can go to our um, elements here, and we can, uh, here we can change, for example, that. So we can jump also, so in, uh, with uh, the, the click on this arrow, we can jump inside this material. And so we can jump uh, uh, very fast inside the material context. This is a little types. So we can create uh, the, um, another principal shader. In uh, Udini, there is also the classic shader. Classic shader, we can use that, for example, for create uh, the glass. The glass maybe is better created with this respect to this. Where is the difference? The difference is the order of your elements, but is not more, for example, some material, some uh, maps, but uh, is more near to the, the, the principal shader. It's very easy to understand that. Here in principal shader, you have some basic material you can use that for started also for study if, if you want. For example, we can uh, create uh, uh, the aluminum. You see how it's setting. And here we can create concrete, we can create the clay, etc. etc. We can see a different kind of dirt material, this is a different kind of uh, material we can use that. Okay, revert to the factory default, it's the default material. And so we can apply, also we can grab and put on material in, in your render view, and you see it's apply without problem. This is the very basic material. Okay, here, if you want, for example, to create the metal material, you can assign for all glass material, reflective material, and we can assign the black color for the base color. We can uncheck also the point color. And we can work, for example, for metallic on reflection, for example, and on EOR. EOR, for example, for metal is 2.5. And you see here we have the metal material. This is one way for create very fast one effects of metal, of chroma. Obviously, 0 0.9 is not more good like uh, the reflection, but uh, it's good for, for us because we can help for don't have uh, the very strong reflection, for example, 0 0.085, I prefer. 
and also the metallic effects can assign 0 0.5 and we can see what's happening now I want for example assign this material only to this uh, shape this uh, round so we can in here we can call for example my chrome or my metal we can come back in the our for example in our object in our shader geometry here i can create the material and from material here i can assign for example my metal material now it's apply to all okay it's up to all because he don't take the group. Here I have one cross and one X. The cross is the plus and you can insert, for example, another material. And here I can delete material. Now the material number two is my metal material. Here with the group and this element is divided by the group. So we can choose that, for example, so we can come back here and delete this and we can see it's apply this material metal material it's apply only the podestan group this part for understanding it i can say you know, i don't want for example the core group we can start with core group. core group is that okay i apply my, my my metal material I want to apply another material here and so I can go in the group number one and I can say okay I want to apply for example to the screw okay another material and I can come back in our material and I can create another principal shader and here for very fast I choose copy Okay, I come back to my object and here I choose cop. I don't know where is up with the cop, the screw, maybe, maybe this part, maybe, okay. And I can, for example, I can also create the delete sop. In the delete sop, I want to create, for example, shader board base. And uh, what is the shader board? Okay, this is this part. So I can say, for example, I can create another group and uh, for my share group that I can come back in my material shop in my material contain uh, my material context and here I can say share plastic maybe I can assign a red Also, I can create another. Now I come back here in geometry, shell group, it's my shell and my pedestal. It's my pipe. Voila! I create a difference. With the group is created before, obviously, I can associate and give a difference material. And this is very comfortable when you work, for example, with a complex geometry, you want, for example, assign difference material and you don't uh, uh, detach every part of geometry, you can apply and uh, you can have this solution.